Well, I made them a path over here, but guess what? Apparently my villagers are like mountain goats and they just go like straight to the mountain. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Matt and welcome back to Foundation! Welcome back to the little town that we have started in the previous two episodes. The thing is, I did not notice because my happiness is going down the drain. As you can see, my happiness is like 42. I'm trying to fix this issue, but I think I screwed up. Why? Well, apparently in the current version of the game, there is this issue that if the villagers leave, and trust me, I had like a, like a spam wave of leaving villagers, if the villagers gonna leave, then their houses become empty and no new villagers can live in that house. So for example, let's say that I have built, uh, I think those houses at the beginning of this, like, little playthrough. There were people living over here. Now, nobody lives over here, like, none. Zero. Same goes, okay, this one, uh, this one actually has somebody in. So, George is living in this house, right? The house next to him? Nobody. House over here? Nobody. This house? Filipinas living over here. All right, this house nobody's living in this house level 3 house nobody's living in it So now the way to fix this thing would be probably to demolish the houses and hopefully fix this thing somehow The issue is that well, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't think I can fix this thing I've screwed up completely. I screwed up this town so badly that I don't think I can actually be able to fix it So so I started a new town <laughs> Yeah, can't fix old, start the new, right? Now, I don't actually like the layout of this town, but it's like a little bit better, all right? Uh, the placement is a little bit better. I have like two uh, mushroom, whatever traders over here. I have two bread traders over here. I have like three windmills over here. This city is slowly and steady evolving. I've built like two farms over here. Basically, the people are happy, like 75, 76. Almost all the time, though they're like kind of mm, they're unhappy because they cannot build houses. Kind of, I don't know why they cannot build houses. I mean, like I told them to build houses, but apparently they cannot. Also, why the hell this house is standing at some of the of the thingy? I don't know. Okay, let's fix this thing quickly. Right. So yeah, it's like the the, the new village is like getting built in a valley type type thingy, not exactly super flat. But okay, we can roll with this thing, right? I've built like a small little camping over here. I've built like some things over here. Let me just turn this thing off. Okay, there you go. I'm making shit loads of money, which is great. I don't have to worry about that thing. So all in all, this town is progressing. Also, I found out that in this version, you don't have to like put one gatherer to a specific gathering point. You can build as many as you want. As long as you're gonna fit it, they will be able to gather it. So we have like four uh, gathering camps over here. All of them like working. They're supplying the town with uh, necessary for the one, whatever. Uh, I have a little bit of issue with the bread, kinda. Yeah, Richie, a lot of issues, you know. Can I like hire somebody? Okay, let's hire somebody over here. Somebody working over here. Okay, two people working over here. I don't know why they have so much difficulties. I mean, you should be able to produce like shit lots of bread, but apparently you don't. I don't know why. Issues, issues, all the time, fucking issues. Okay, send somebody over here as well. Work, morons, work. All in all. It maybe look worse, but it's just working, right? <laughs> also, I can like expand the territory like a lot. I've built, I've built, I bought or, like already a bunch of land over here. And I want to buy this land. There you go. Thank you. Beauty freaking fall. Right. So, let's get into building of the chapel. I have designed the chapel, the monastery actually over here. And I'm. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> go back. I want to make a small. Uh, graveyard over here. If I could only find the cross. There it is. Look, I can even make a freaking graveyard. Like, this is not exactly like a graveyard. This is like just the crosses from the top of the buildings. But it looks like a graveyard, right? So this is what is important. Okay, let's make like more. In between. Cross. There we go. It's gonna be nice. And it's gonna be nice. Okay, so I have designed this this little like... Uh, Monastery, little monastery, let's put it this way. I want to increase the size of this thing, but I can't. Can I make a door over here? Uh, I want to rotate you. Crap, I need to increase the size of this. How I can increase the size? I think I can't. Now I can. Okay, and door, and place it like over here. There you go. So nice. Also, I can put like some decorative trees. This one over here. This one over here. This one over here. Like, this is the... Oh, no, this is actually, like... Oh, my God, this thing is actually quite big. Take it to three. Take it to three. Nice! This is gonna be so bloody good. <laughs> this is gonna be great. Okay, people are living, but not as much as they did in the previous town. Right. Okay, I need 800 gold. 
that could be an issue, but hopefully they somehow gonna manage. All right, start building. <laughs> it's gonna take a while. <laughs> oh, it's gonna take a lot of time to build this motherfucking thing. Okay, let's check the houses. Most of the houses have somebody in. Right, one people, two people. As long as some people are like living over there, I'm fine. This camp is not working, so let's assign workers because we need stone, man. We need shitloads of stone to fulfill construction of dust monstrosity. All right, so I'm gonna leave them as they are. Not gonna touch them for now. Okay, now the next thing I wanted to build is walls. You can actually build bloody walls if you want to. So, and uh, let's start from this cliff over here. And I want to no all the way around. Need you to have the battlements needs to be outside, not inside. You dipshit. Oh, okay. How I can? Uh huh. What? Nice. Nice. Okay, I want to go from this one. How the hell I can continue building? And she shoot it. There we go. I built a wall. <laughs> I even built like something that's supposed to be like a tower. <laughs> I only have the wall tool, right? I don't have a, like an actual tower tool. So I have to work with whatever I have. Okay, this is gonna be nice. This is gonna be great. Okay, how I can... Oh, it's already finished. Nice. I actually managed to build a fucking wall around this thing. Who would have guessed? Some de decorative stuff around. Let's make it look pretty. Yeah, probably building trees thanks to a defensive wall is not the brightest of my ideas. You know, when it comes to actually defending my ass from incoming assaults, rights. <laughs> but, you know how it is? <laughs> decorative things first. Okay, now I need to remember. Okay, they won't be cutting those trees down, so that's gonna be nice. Okay, how's the construction of the chapel? Of the monastery? It's progressing, slowly and steady. Alright, nothing I can do over here, I just have to like give them time to build that monstrosity. They are still building my monstrosity. <laughs> They're actually capable, look! This thing actually looks like a graveyard. Oh, saving game. Okay, thank you. Right, this is gonna be bloody cool. Oh man, I'm so happy the way you can actually like build structures in this game. This is so fucking unique. Like, you can make your every single city look unique because of this thing. Like, you can design a chapels, you can design churches, you can design monasteries, you can just design... Uh, manners, castles, like everything. I, I would love to have like even more tools like this, like maybe canals or something like, I don't know, maybe like actual fortification walls, like more more of a, like a wall building tool, like, you know, we can make like abutments, towers, uh, I don't know, dead holes, stuff like that. That would be so fucking cool. Uh, it's gonna be fucking great when the game comes to actually like full release. This is just the alpha build, you know, just keep this thing in mind. This is alpha build. Things are like not working, they're like placeholders. But look, it already looked nice. Let me just turn off this. Ah, there you go. Oh, okay, I thought for a second that this thing is not working. I think, no, I have grain. Why the hell this thing is not working as it's supposed to work? I don't know. So nice. Ah, so fucking nice. I can also build some bushes over here. There you go, much better. Ah, mm, so cozy, nice. Uh, I'm gonna put some decorative trees as well, maybe. Fuck, people are living. Why? What happened? Could not find bread. Lack like berries. What do you mean, lack of berries? You have shitloads of fucking berries over here. Alright, I'm gonna build like one more market thingy over here and hope for the best. Whoa, people are upgrading houses like crazy. Something happened. <laughs> We're just upgrading houses. We're just upgrading houses. I don't. Oh, I don't have planks. Whoops. Sorry about that. Let's, uh, I need planks. Probably I need planks for this thing as well. Yeah. Literally, they're lacking only planks to finish this construction. Holy shit, it's gonna be so nice. I cannot wait for that finish. The chapel is about... The chapel, I mean. The monastery is finally finished. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho. Tower sequence. What? You can change the sounds of the bell towers. What? What? <laughs> yeah, they still go for the freaking walls, but okay, whatever. Oh my god. Four new buildings unlocked, and I think I'm gonna get swarmed with building upgrades right now, because this thing is massive. Okay, what do we have? Oh, road signs. Ooh. Wait, what? So I needed to build. I don't know what this thing is for, so I'm just gonna, like, build a few of them. One over here, one over here, one over here. I'm gonna make the town look pretty. I'm gonna make the town look beautiful. One over here. Uh, one next to the well. And, like, let's say one over here somewhere. There we go. Oh my god, look at this pound. Oh my god, this is gonna backfire at me very soon. Uh, okay. So now, we need to get ships. 
and okay i have unlocked everything <laughs> right off the bat oh crap <laughs> i don't think this is actually good probably this is a terrible thing to happen i don't know we're gonna see all right so now we need to worry about clothing hmm so i've learned one thing that the ship building actually spawns the ship from with uh, within itself so i'm gonna build this thing over here and i need to cut down the trees oh reforestation okay we're gonna see how that thing works very soon Okay, cut down this thing. There's actually anybody working at the... Uh, okay, nobody's working over here. Hire somebody to cut down the trees. Oh my god. <laughs> the town is getting built like crazy. Here we go with the unhappiness. Shit, I should have predicted that thing. Crap. Very not good. Very not good. Okay, people living over here, living over here. This is bad. <laughs> this is very bad. This is terrible, actually. Nobody living at the town center. Not good, not good. Okay, decorative tree. Okay, somebody's living over here, so that's nice. I just have to destroy the towns, I mean the towns, the houses that are like empty. Because A, they take space. B, uh, no, no new people can live with them. And upgrading a house that nobody's gonna use? Waste of resources, you know, in the long term. Alright, hopefully this thing is under control now. Okay, assign people over here to work at the gatherers because some people have apparently left and we are lacking food. Which is not super great. It's actually very terrible. Just saying. Okay, it should be it should be okay to okay now. Beautiful. Ah, the ship farm is finished. Okay, uh need to do some decorative fences around this thing so the ship won't actually run away. So let's do something like this. I can heal the church in the background. <laughs> the bells are ringing for people to gather for prayers. For whom? Uh, for the never-ending immortal god emperor? Probably. <laughs> Maybe. For the emperor! It's better to die for the emperor than live for yourself. Of course it is. Uh, let's make something like this. Actually, don't wait. Can I destroy this? This, I screwed up. And done. There we go. Okay, now let's spawn some ships. Yeah! Okay, uh, well, they're outside. <laughs> this is something I did not want to happen. Well, okay, whatever. Like, leave them where they are. Not a biggie. Not a big issue. Right, people are living. As long as somebody is living in the houses, I'm fine. Because those are probably the people who wanted to live in the city. But they don't have, like, a... Uh, like, a free space to build their houses at the moment. So, I'm fine with that thing. I mean, those are, like, just... People without actual, like, living space. Okay, this one's somebody living over here. Nobody's living over here. Okay, somebody's living over here. Somebody's living over here. Somebody's living over here. Nobody's living over here. Destroy. Something is living over here. <laughs> Something. Let's build the forester camp over here. And see how this thing is actually gonna go. So this is the forester guy. And I'm gonna build like... Two woodcutter camps next to him. Uh, let's say like here. There we go. Okay, they're gonna build this thing, and this is supposed to supply me with necessary trees, right? Hopefully. Uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna, like, cut this thing off so that they won't try to cut down the trees just next to the wall. There we go. But, we are allowed to cut all of this. All of this thing is allowed to get cut. Okay, I don't have money to actually extend my kingdom for now. So I'm just gonna, like, uh, design this thing. There they go. Beautiful. Beautiful indeed. Okay, something like this, and now the forestation is gonna go the same way. I kinda like wonder how this thing works. Ah, my village is finally almost ready. Like, if we're gonna solve the issue with some people living, actually, this is gonna be all fun and dancing. Right, in the meantime, time to build the final structure, which is the Lord Manor. Ooh. Okay, how the hell am I supposed to build this thing? Okay, let's see, we have the Lord House Core, then we have Extension A, Treasury. Ooh, Treasury. Expand the treasury capacity of your land. Resources needed to build. Okay, that's nice. Door. Nice. Chimney. Okay, nice. Decorative tree. Fence. Decorative bush. Ooh. Fountain. Really? A fountain? Oh. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be nice. Right, so... If I'm gonna build this thing, like, let's say, over here... I'm gonna make it, like, really bloody tall. Too bad you cannot move the fucking windows. Hmm. Okay, I need to think exactly how I'm gonna build this thing. I even have found, like, Lord Banner. There we go. Okay, this is gonna look nice. I'm gonna make this thing look fancy as seven hells. And by seven hells, I mean it's gonna be, like, really, hopefully, very pretty. Can I move this thing closer? Come on, move it close. Well, actually... Well, as it fits, I sit, right? Move it like this. 
Ah, oh, crap, I cannot align this thing. Or actually... Yeah, it's fine, we can work with this. Okay, they've got like a bunch of trees over here. So, I planted this thing to get planted, right? So let's hire somebody here. <laughs> One female is about to plant this entire forest. Well, I wish her good bloody luck. In the meantime, I'm gonna hire some... Okay, I hired somebody over here. Right. City so far is standing, which is great. I almost finished this thing. I'm gonna probably completely cut out the building process. Like, me designing this thing, because this just takes too long. It's like, honestly, just takes so bloody long to finish this. So I'm just gonna, like, do whatever I can. Uh, where I can put this thing, though? Rotate it. Okay, like this. Why the hell no? A bit lower. There you go. Okay. I forgot completely to build a treasury. Oh, yeah. Can I put this thing on a... I don't think I can put this thing on a building. Can I, like, increase this? Ooh! Sweet! New plan. Need to put the treasures, like, in a different place. Uh, how about here? Ooh! Nice! Okay, one more treasury. Uh, what the hell I can put you, actually? Put it, like, over here. <laughs> this is gonna look weird. But all right, whatever. One more treasury, please. Uh, here. Nice! <laughs> This looks like a piece of shit. All uh, right, some decorative trees maybe inside. Decorative bush. Ooh, oh yes, 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 yes. Decorative bushes. There we go. Fountain. Something maybe. I don't know what to put a freaking fountain. Okay, this one's not fitting over here. I completely forgot about you. Nah, where I can put you? I don't know where I can put you. Here. No. Next to you. Maybe, maybe here. Okay, looks terrible, but okay, whatever. Uh, anything else? No, I think this is actually fine. 600 stone, 545 wood, and 200 tools. Wow! That's gonna take a while to build. Start construction. <laughs> it's gonna take a while. In the meantime, my forester is actually, like, working. Look! Oh my gosh, she's so efficient, really. Like, this was, like, almost empty. Entirely. And then she's just, like, planting trees like crazy. That's so motherfucking impressive. What the hell? <laughs> I'm gonna have unlimited trees for this thing. Sweet! Well, I made them a path over here, but guess what? Apparently, my villagers are like mountain goats and they just go like straight to the mountain. <laughs> path fighting needs to, be, needs to be fixed in this game because this thing is just ridiculous. Look at them. <laughs> Gravity? What? Who? <laughs> Bullshit. Well, looks like this is gonna be the downfall of my city once again. Second town already, second downfall. <laughs> I'm two, 400 on the minus because the upkeep costs me like a bunch. Like, the f this thing, even though this thing is not finished yet, the upkeep costs me like 126 gold. <laughs> like, what the fuck? This thing is 40 gold. And apparently the only way to make money in this game is by selling. And I don't have resources because people are unhappy. Well, I don't have people because they cannot fulfill their needs and I don't have resources because people are leaving so uh yeah it's, it's going straight downhill once again bloody hell ah uh, the worst thing about this thing is that I cannot force the game to upkeep like a certain amount, amount of people like for example I want the gatherers hut to always have somebody working over here let's say like three people and I cannot force the game to do so like once they leave I have to figure out myself W which building is no longer working? <laughs> See, empty house, empty house. Okay, Maria is living over here, okay. Uh, empty house, once again. Nobody working in the bakery. How the fuck am I supposed to figure out that thing out? No idea. Somebody's working over here. Somebody's living over here. Somebody's living over here. Windmill is working. Right, so far, nobody left. Maybe this is good? Okay, nobody working at the bakery. Great. Super, yeah, fine, love it. Okay, two new people join at me, that's sweet. Kinda hope that they actually will be able to build something. Uh, sometimes they start to build a house, and before the house is gonna get finished, they just leave. <laughs> that's like another thing that fucking annoys me. Why you are not making food? What the hell? You have all the resources needed. Expect for... Wait, what? Oh, no. Flower? You have flower? What? Why you do not work? Guys, I think this is stable. So far, nobody left. <laughs> as stupid as it sounds, that's the bloody truth. Alright, save the game. 
Okay, the FPS went a little bit to shit, probably because of I have uh, how many stuff I have placed. But okay, that's that's alright. This thing still requires shitloads of resources to get built. Holy shit, boss! That's gonna take a while to build. Spoke to soon. There you go. <laughs> We're just living to, to unhappiness. I can't, cannot even like select him to check what's his bloody issue. No, I'm leaving because I don't like the people over there. I don't like it because you make the path a little bit not on the angle. <laughs> I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I just ran out of food almost completely. And I cannot finish this thing. <laughs> like, I'm sitting here for the past three hours and the only thing I hear is a plong. Two people left. Plong. One people left. Plong. It's so fucking annoying. If the developers won't fix this stupid sound, I swear to God. Ah! Motherfucker. I swear. All right, you know what? I'm tired, right? I'm just sitting here for the past three hours. Cannot finish this construction. I mean, like, I'm happy with the amount of stuff you can build, but just the building itself is like a such a fucking pain in the ass. I mean, they're delivering the 12 remaining tools for the past half an hour. Somebody's picking 12 tools and then he's leaving the town with the tools, right? So a new delivery needs to come with the tools. Somebody pick up the tools and then... <laughs> He wants to deliver the tools to the building side, and then you're like, Pleong! the villager left. Ah, fucking, I think I overdid this. Note to self, if you're gonna be playing this game, don't build such a big thing like th at the beginning, otherwise you're gonna just go to shit. Like, somehow I've managed to build this thing, but I can't finish the fucking Lord's Manor. Why? Oh, see? She's building 12 tools, where is she? Uh, follow. Okay, where is she? Where is she? Where is she? There she is, okay. Why are you not moving? I'm stuck! You ca- Oh, okay, there she goes. Where the fuck she's going? She went to the house, okay, well, she's going with the tools. So, kinda like hoping that she's gonna finally deliver them to the pulling side. Okay, now she goes to the church with the tools. Okay, now she's going. She's going to fetch some resources, okay. Alright, I want to see. Okay, she's... Now she's grabbing wood? What? Now she's building complete, something completely different. Why you do such a thing to me? Hmm. No idea. No idea how to fix this. <laughs> 20 year old female. Dump as fuck. That should be the trait. Dump as 7 fuck. Oh, great. You're building completely something different. Uh, village left. With me. See, the, the, the tools are still like not delivered. <laughs> alpha. This is what happens when you try to build fancy stuff when it comes to alpha and people are like living. Alright, no point of keeping this thing up. I'm 1000 gold on the minus anyway, so this is completely beyond me fixing. I mean, I could probably fix this thing, but I'm too lazy and just too tired to actually try. <laughs> so the thing is, I'm gonna keep my eye on, on the development of this game. It's like she interesting title. Just the alpha build is b is bugged. I mean, like normal alpha. So no, 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 no expectations over here. Though it's just an interesting title. It has promises. Like it has great promises. The amount of stuff you can do over here. The amount of unique stuff you can build over here is also quite nice. So I'm gonna keep my eye on, on the development. Hopefully in the future there's gonna be more playable version. Hopefully the villagers won't bug themselves so easily because this is so this is just ridiculous. Okay, somebody's bring the resources, the tools once again. Okay, let's see where is he going. Okay, there he is. He's stuck. <laughs> How? You've managed to deliver the previous like 67 resources, the 67 tools, and now you just get bugged and he cannot deliver them. No idea why. No idea what, and I just said I'm just too tired to even try. So, for now, I think I'm gonna leave this little series over here. If you want to try the game yourself, I don't think you can yet, but you can add the game to your wish list if you really want to. So, don't hesitate to do so, because as I said, the game shows really great promises. I cannot wait for the future development, I cannot wait for the developers are actually gonna finish the game. Hopefully, I'll be able to come back to it very soon with the box fixed. I mean, the developers are fixing this stuff constantly. Like, I think today I downloaded already like two patches. So, you know, they're just fixing this stuff. It's alpha. So, obviously, there's gonna be like some bugs here and there. Uh, anything else? I don't think so. Oh, yeah, one more thing. Change the fucking villagers' living sound. It's annoying. It's really pretty annoying. Ah, oh, so fucking annoying. <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go crazy if I'm gonna hear this stupid sound one more time. So you know what? 
I'm rambling too much. So I think I'm just gonna cut it as it's over here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you liked the episode, please press the like button. Thanks a lot. Yep, see you all in the next video.